Well, the second is the Ladbrook Marathon Leg 1 Qualifier. Uh, Basket Briggs, Joshua Sutherland, Harrow Tiddy, David Robertson, October Bay, Graham Tulliver, Canterbury, John Morgan, Rainbow River, Martin Needham, Ray Ross, David Robertson, Hills Patchy, Dan Hughes, How Rise, Craig Beckwith, Star Daddy, Alex Cherry, Darton and Ars, Obi Wan, and Us Carol, Obi Wan. 11 horses in this uh, first leg of the qualifier over 1 mile 7 furlongs. The finals are on week 12 um, in the season. And away they go. A very slow jump by Rainbow River. Uh, for Martin Needham. As they sort themselves out, it's Obi-Wan's Ask Carl who goes up to lead from Hills Patchy for Dan News. In between horses is Busker Briggs for Joshua Sullen. Star Daddy is right there for Alex Jerry. Out wide is Canterbury for John Morgan. Then comes uh, October Bay for Graham Clatterbuck. On that one's outside is Rainbow River after that slow start, but he is travelling wide. On the rail is Craig Beck was high rise with that smart season kit white cap and the blue body. Then comes uh, Hills Patchy and uh, the two David Robertson horses at the back of the field, Harrow Tedley and Ray Ross. So ask Carol the leader from Dancing on Ice. They're followed by um, Canterbury back in third. Then comes Buster Briggs for Joshua Sutherland. They're followed by October Bay with High Rise and that one's inside. Rainbow River is travelling wide. The blue coloured uh, blue colours of Hills Patchy on the inside of the two David Robertson horses, Harrow Teddy and Ray Ross and Star Daddy at the back of the field. They've got about 10 phones left to travel, and it's Obi-1-1-2, yeah. Haas Coral leads some dancing on ice. John Morgan's Canterbury back in third. Then comes Busker Briggs for Joshua Sutherland in those red and black stripes. October Bay just behind that for uh, Graham Clutterback. Five in a line behind that. Uh, on the inside is High Rise. Then Haas High Hills Patchy on that one's outside. The two David Robertson horses, Howard Tedley and Ray Ross, are together. Then out wide is Rainbow River and Star Daddy looks on from the rear. About eight lengths off the leader as Oscar will takes them along from Busker Briggs in second now Dancing on Ice back in third Canterbury's always in there about in fourth October Bay just behind those and there's a back great bake of about four lengths to Dan Hughes' Hills Patchy who's on the outside of High Rise uh, the two David Robertson's also still together Harrow, Tedley and Ray Ross and Star Daddy at the back of the field with the Rainbow River so six villains left to travel yet Newcastle and Oscar will takes them along from Busker Briggs in second uh, Busker Briggs only about two lengths off the leader now Canterbury is on the outside of Dancing on Ice, the second RB1 horse. In between those is October Bay. Then comes Hills High Rise and Hills Patchy. Uh, Star Daddy is creeping closer for Alex Cherry. On the outside of that is Ray Ross. Then comes Rainbow River and Harrow Tedley at the back of the field. The Grey Horse for David Robertson. Four firms left to travel as they approach the entrance to the home straight. And House Coral, the leader from Basket Briggs with October Bay on that one's outside. Canterbury still right there for John Morgan. Moving closer as Hills Patchy. On the outside, Rainbow River trying to get going with Star Daddy, but it's still Ask Coral in front with three photos left to travel from October Bay now in second. Moving closer on the outside is uh, Ray Draw. Something has gone wrong with Harrow or Tedley. It's uh, Ask Coral in front from October Bay in second. Then comes Ray Ross, who's finishing strongly for David Robertson. Ray Ross and Star Daddy come to grab Ask Coral. Ray Ross picks it up from Star Daddy, running on his uh, October Bay. Canterbury's going up and down, and High Rise is trying to get going, but Ray Ross. Ross hits the front for David Robertson and Ray Ross starts to extend. It's Ray Ross in front from Star Daddy. He's trying to rally in second. Ray Ross, yeah, comes Star Daddy for Alex Jerry. Finishes strongly on the outside. It's Harrow Tidley from nowhere. Star Daddy wins it from Ray Ross in second. I think the stable mate Harrow Tidley, who came from a very unpromising position to finish third. But Alex Cherry wins the second and Newcastle with Star Daddy who gets up on the post to beat Ray Ross who looked to winner with a further left to go. Harrow Tedley was back in third for David Robertson, finishes second and third. October Bay, Graham Cutter was back in fourth and Canterbury for John Morgan looks like he needs further was back in fifth.